All right, how's it going guys? Figured I'd bring you a quick video talking about these NECA display stands. I just picked these up at Target. They were like $9.99, 10 bucks. Figure display stands, NECA, ages six and up. You can see, right, eight and up. It's a 10 count on the bottom there. Turning it proudly posed, your favorite six to eight inch action figures with these three and a half diameter black finish display stands with two exclamation marks. Compatible with most six to eight inch action figures. Okay, we will see how these work. Um, 10 of them, all right, let's see how they do. So here we have one of the display stands. Now they come with these plastic pieces right here, which I don't think are very necessary, but whatever. So first, starting out, take a look at these figures. It is probably the uh, figure line everyone's most curious about, Marvel Legends. So let's use the uh, pizza Spidey and we'll see how this works. Ooh, it's a little awkward. It almost seems like, okay, it offers some stability, definitely, like it helps, but the peg is a little bit too long. So, I mean, maybe we could just like shave it down. I don't know, we'll see, I'll get back to you. Okay, so I shaved it down a little bit and it did help a lot. I did kind of a half-ass job and filed this down, as you can see, but it it actually helped quite a bit. So it works for Spider-Man. We'll try out one more Legends figure, just for picks. Let's say 80th anniversary Captain America, just because I think this figure's fucking sweet. Um, putting him on it. Oh my god, that works very well. Not gonna lie, that's that's very nice. Let's try it with a stand though that I haven't shaved down, just in case there's people out there who don't want to take the time to do that. I know it's not very convenient, it's kind of annoying. So we'll take that and like that. Works. Yeah, that works pretty freaking well. Ooh, maybe not too well. It's almost too small for him. I don't know why, it seemed to work better with this stand. Let's see. Honestly, no. Now that I'm looking at it, I think I just had some plastic sitting on there funny that uh, I shaved off. It was still might have been stuck on or something. He's very loose on there. It doesn't really do much for him. Why don't we try just one more. Let's do a 80th anniversary Wolverine from the two pack with Hulk. I'm guessing it's probably gonna be about the same, but we'll still try it. Eh, he actually fits on there all right. That's a shaved one though, let's try. Yeah, no, he fits on both of them pretty well. So with that said, there are certain figures that will work with these in the Legends line, and obviously some that won't. Um, for $10, I mean, it's worth buying and trying out with some figures and just taking a look and seeing what works and what doesn't work. Do one more here, the, since the Bucky cap mold. It doesn't really work with Bucky, the Bucky cap. Um, Cyclops buck, so that doesn't really work much. So, I mean, it is what it is. It's ten dollars, you might as well try it out. Obviously, with these NECA figures, it'll probably work with Freddy Krueger, works pretty damn well, which is primarily why I bought them. Because, you know, some of these NECA figures, uh, if there's anything you notice about NECA, it's that their figures have a tendency to break. You know, and it's not a huge deal. I mean, it does kind of suck, but they're beautiful pieces of art, man. They're great figures, and I absolutely love buying them. But if they fall, sometimes they have little pieces and stuff. That will break, so it'd be nice to have these stands. It's a bummer that they're sold separately, but with these NECA figures, the stands do work really freaking well, man. So, and that's probably the most important thing for me. Otherwise... We can take a look with a few more figures. Let's see here. So, for every figure you see in this shot here, um, these stands do work really well. So, DC Essentials, so far it has worked for the one figure I have that has pegs in his feet. Um, for all the NECA figures, it obviously works. Mythic Legions, it works for the Shadow Elf Ranger. For these two Black Series figures, it works. 
But for the most part, um, the Black Series is kind of a gamble in terms of uh, whether they'll stay on the stand or not. I know Darth Maul did not work, but it's kind of a hit or a miss with Hasbro figures, it seems. The only figure line I have not um, placed on those stands, simply because they usually come with their own stands, is uh, the McFarlane line. Now, SH Figure Arts and Mafex do not have uh, pegs in their feet, or peg holes in their feet that I noticed on the two figures that I have. Well, it does work for the McFarlane figures a little bit. It's a little, little, little loose, but you're probably just better off using the stands that they come with, honestly. And they look very, very similar. Just a little thicker. But they do not work for Mafex and SH Figure Arts, neither have peg holes in their feet. At least the figures that I have do not. Um, the Samurai line of Star Wars and Marvel characters also do not have pegs in their feet. Uh, peg holes in their feet, at least mine doesn't. The uh, only line that I wish it worked for was Mezco, but it does not work for Mezco, unfortunately. They do come with stands, however, it is nice to have figure stands like these that, uh, work in, that you could kind of hide in the toy photography aspect, but they don't really work for the Mezco figures. It is nice to know they work for these DC Essentials figures, though, because this Joker was a pain in my ass to stand up, man. But these all look really nice. I do recommend these stands. Hell, for only $10, man, why the fuck not? Just buy them. They, they work pretty freaking well. I mean, I definitely don't have any problems with them. They're fun to use, and yeah, they seem to work. So, with that said, thanks for watching this. Hopefully it wasn't too long. Um, I hope you guys go out and buy these, because they do work pretty well. Have fun with them. Nearly $10. Pretty easy to find a target back by the collectibles and stuff. Anyways, thanks guys, thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment, talk to me, and give me your thoughts on these stands and your experience that you've had, um, or any figures that I didn't show in this video that these would work with. So, uh, thanks guys, and um, keep collecting.